Things first, I would love to give definition and meaning a special thank you for sending me these shirts to cut up for today's video. And today I am going to be showing you how to make a cute simple dress out of two t-shirts, a patchwork idea. Next, you're going to want to take one half of each shirt and lay them directly next to each other. And then since we are making a dress, I'm going to use this old dress that I've been using in the last couple videos as a stencil. And I'm going to lay that right in between both of these t-shirts. Make sure that if there is a pattern on the shirt, you want to line that up evenly. Now you want to cut out this dress shape, leaving a little bit of extra fabric on the side for seam allowance so that it's not too small when you are sewing it. I like to leave at least an inch of seam allowance and or extra fabric um, on the sides just to make sure it's gonna fit perfect. Just to make sure that the both sides are going to be the exact same, I'm going to flip the blue side onto the red side and cut out the red side from the blue side. Just basically matching it up perfectly. I usually do this all the time when I'm cutting out fabric. I'll fold it in half just to make sure one side is going to be cut like the other side if I'm not using a pattern. To how how it looks so far um the bottom parts that aren't even but it's fine i'll fix it next i did cut me a couple strips of fabric for the string and then you also need a casing for the string i cut two blue and two reds um each were 30 and a half inches but i didn't end up using both i just used one and then the um, actual casing is going to be two inches um wide and 19 inches long, 19 to 20 inches long um, for the actual casings on the side of the dress. So make sure you are cutting those out also. Since we are doing a patchwork design, um, I'm gonna open up each side of the dress and turn them inside out. And then I will line both of them up so we can sew it straight down the middle to attach it together.
did pin them together just so it's easier for you to understand where I'm sewing and also so it's easier for me to keep the design together and you know so it's matched up perfectly and I'm going to use my brother's serger but you can use a sewing machine it doesn't matter I just really like sergers they're really really easy to use and they're faster Once both sides of the dress are sewn together, it'll look like this. And you just want to close up both sides here. And that's what I was gesturing to. And I'm just going to sew up um, the red side and sew up the blue side so that it'll make it one cohesive piece. Next, you want to take the 2 inch wide, 19 inch long strip of fabric that you cut and you want to attach it to the side of the dress. And you are going to want to do three lines of stitches, one down the left side, one down the right side, and one straight down the middle. And this is going to be a casing for your string that we cut out, so it'll give it a ruching effect on the side. And you're going to do the exact same thing for the blue side and the red side. Now we're going to thread our string straight through the casing that we just made and since this is a t-shirt fabric you can just pull on the piece of fabric and it'll roll up so you don't have to do what we usually do to make a string this is fine and then i'm just taking a safety pin on one end and threading it through 
the casing that we just made and after that we are done This was super simple and once I got it threaded through, I just added a little bow to the sides of my little t-shirt dress. And here's the finished product. It was so cute. I'll see you guys tomorrow in my next video. Bye!